All right, guys, and what is going on? This is the Club of the Man 1993, and Happy New Year to you all. We are back again, and I'm sorry it's been a while, but I was just, you know, busy with the holidays and other streams, so I kind of put this on hold for a couple weeks. Uh, but we are back and continue on the um, the Let's Play of my Backyard Baseball 2003 season gameplay. Last time we left off, we were halfway through the regular season. We're now 7-0. and We got another victory, of course. So let me check the standings right here really quick. And we are three games up of the on the Hornets. So we got a good pad of lead. I'd say a couple more wins and a couple more losses from the Hornets. We should be able to clinch that by like 10 or 11 wins. I'd say if we were really undefeated. Uh, scheduled next, looks like we've got the Diamondbacks. We're going to be away, so we haven't had an away game for a while. Um, so, without further ado, let's get started with this. Hopefully, Keisha Phil doesn't have a bad game with last time. Oh, man, we're at one of these, um, the Paveway Fields. Not a big fan of this field. So, first, let's see, you know, what our situation is first with our players. Pablo's fine. Intro, ooh, yes, Intro's got 10 for batting. Nice. We've got Ahmed is fine, I'm fine, Angela's fine, No More's fine, Luan's usual boost up, Randy's fine, and okay, so we're pretty good, so we can go back, but first let's get this lineup fixed here, Keisha's going back to batting second, um, moving everyone else down here in the lineup, I believe you have No More fifth, uh, put Keisha back in left field, um, Randy's going to catch this game, put Angela at pitcher, Pablo at third, Luan at second. Um, all right, so we'll go with that um, right here. Let's check the Diamondbacks roster. That's right, they would have Randy Johnson, but haha, we got him instead. Um, so we see here, Davey Marion is a pretty good hitter. Oh, Francis Bluer is good. Artie Pimbleton, a eh, decent player. Uh, oh, Zena Frome, she's great. You gotta watch out for her. Perry Marks having a pretty good day, so watch out for him. Um, Rafael Garbonzos, good hitter. Um, Vladimir Womack having a little bit of a good day, so add on there. Uh, Amanda Hellerman, who's pretty much, you know, having Randy Johnson's numbers, so she's our pitcher. And, of course, Dimitri Petrovich, who's got some decent hitting, as we all know. So, a pretty good hitting team, I gotta say, so we better, you know, try to keep their bats cold and see what we can do here. But without further ado, guys, let's get started with the game, shall we? And Happy New Year, by the way, if I have not said so, since today is January 1st. Uh, which I probably did at the beginning, uh, but, you know, I forget very easily sometimes. Although, I do have a good memory about other things, too, but, you know, we all have those little brain farts here and there. All right, so let's get started this game with Amanda Hellerman pitching for the Diamondbacks. Ichiro is going to lead off because he's having a pretty hot day as he has 10 for hitting this game. I don't know if that means 10 for power or whatever. Probably more, more power, so let's just have a little fun here. Let's see if we can hit some power, although hitting a home run in this field is not easy unless he hit the straightaway center. Strike. Does Dimitri ever shut up? You hear him talk about his statistics, but then again, you know, I, I love Dimitri. I, I, I can't crap on Dimitri too much. Oh, nice little one drive in there to center field. Oh, nice catch for them to um, get one out. Keisha Phillips bad 709. Last game again, remember, remember she had like that really bad game, lost a lot of numbers, but she still they got one or two hits despite that. So her hitting streak is alive. Still has the best average on the team, I believe. Oh, swung late at that for strike one. So, yeah, I hope you... I mean, I know yeah, I'm really talking to you guys more so through the uh, old line drive there. That's going to be a base hit for Keisha. Um, but uh, I haven't really talked to you guys, like, through gaming, um, you know, for a while. So, it's more so been through my streams. And I also wanted to, um, you know, spend time um, uh, updating my... Um, well, getting... I wanted to do that Christmas special for Wolfenstein, so I wanted to finish um, Hitler at the, Hitler the Ninth Gate first, which, you know, that eighth um, gate was pretty long and kind of a tough one to get through. Uh, but I wanted to do the Christmas special, so I had, like, a little bit of, like, a um, foul ball there. A little bit of, like, a routine going with, you know, getting, like, these, all three of these Let's Plays finished. Ah, oh, I should have crushed that Pablo. Uh, so, you know, I, I, I put these two on hold. Uh, this one, my Harry Potter Let's Play, so I'm going to catch up with that uh, over the next few days, and then I will, you know, get back on track and start um, Adam Project soon, but, um, but you know, so I haven't really talked to you guys, now my Christmas was pretty good, spent it with family, get my sister was home, um, and let's keep to a single there, because again, this park sucks, uh, but, um, you know, got some pretty good gifts this year, um, 
you know, nothing really too fancy to help the channel or anything. Or, you know, my parents, you know, um, are, um, you know, paying for my subscription for my editing software this year, which is a nice little gesture from them. Um, oh, nice one. Uh, that was hit hard, but I don't think it's going to be deep enough. Nope. Oh, oh, Keisha fell down. No, 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 get back, back, back. Okay, we're good. I was doing it too. Let's be on, on pavement this time. Um, the ball's going to bounce a lot. Because we're in the grass or at, at home with Ekman Acres. Um, yeah, but, um, you know, other than that, you know, had a pretty good holiday, I gotta say. You know, get looking forward to a fresh start to the new year. And Old oh, dropped that one. So we're going to get a run on this one. Uh, so an RBI single for Nomar. So 1 nothing lead for the Pirates here in the first. Uh, but yeah, so you know, New Year's, you know, was, wasn't too bad. You know, I lost a skip out of my parents three times, a game I can never beat my parents at. Um, but, um, you know, I, um, I, um, but, you know, I, um, I also, um, you know, just again, I was looking forward to the new year, you know. You know, again, 27, 2018, you know, had its ups and downs, but, you know, it's always good to have a fresh start sometimes and, you know, just have a new year. Turn the page. Let's see what has in store for us this year. Again, you know, the channel is going to be pretty fun still with, you know, rocking with my wrestling videos, my baseball videos. Again, I'm going to continue to do video game Let's Plays and not just Wolfenstein games. I want to try to do all the Harry Potter. Well, I only have um, um, Chamber of Secrets, Sorcerer's Stone. That's in a terrible order, as I was mentioning before. But again, Chamber of Secrets, Sorcerer's Stone, and Prisoner of Azkaban for the computer. And then... Um, you know, I, I want to do back your baseball 2009 at some point as well. Ah, there's the final out there. But we got one run that inning, so not bad of a start. Angela Del Vecchio is going to pitch for us today. And wow, they're going to have Dmitry Petrovich lead off. Dmitry's got some decent speed, but I would say he's one of the fastest runners, especially if he's playing catcher today. I always liked, liked, liked the way Dimitri uh, swung the bat in this game. I don't know why. I thought it was just funny. He just jumps. Like, if I tried doing that, if I tried doing that, I'm pretty sure I wouldn't be able to make clean contact at all. But then again, you know, I, you know, now you know, like, you know, of course this is years, years later. I protest. I'm pretty sure, you know, and maybe he was a fan of the Big Bang Theory. I'm pretty sure Dimitri Petrovich would fit in just well with that crowd. Um, with, um, you know, with, like, you know, Sheldon and Leonard and Wall Woods and all that. I feel like he, he would easily fit in with them. Or, of course, if you watched Survivor this past season, um, and if you remember uh, Christian, I'm pretty sure he'd fit in with them as well. But Demetrius is a cool dude. I, I, I feel like he's definitely one of the more uh, underrated players um, for, the back, for the backyard kids. Uh, we've got Davey Marion back. I was back in 320. He was a pretty good force in the left field, looks like, so we better not take him too lightly. Again, this Diamondback seems like they have a lot of good hitters. The last game we played the Giants, I remember now, we, again, it's been a while, but, um, nice! Strike three, two strikeouts to start off, off the inning, um, but, um, I remember the Giants didn't really have any hitters besides Barry Bonds, and, um, ah, who was the other girl? It was a girl, I can't remember exactly who it was, but, um, oh well. Give her, let's give uh, Zena. Oh wait, I shouldn't have fooled around that because if she gets in the one, she can crush it. Oh, strike! Yeah, be careful again. She can hit. You always get the laws of physics. What are you talking about there, Vinny? Oh shoot! Oh, Pablo, nice, nice little snag by Pablo there. One, two, three inning, but that was a close one. Angelo Del Vecchio is batting now. I just decided to skip, you know, the inning break here and there, here thing there. But you know, five eighteen for Angie. She probably is a homer. Just, just crack one. We're not going down the line. That this one. Right. <sighs> Remember when I was little, I used to try to imitate a lot of these players' batting stances, the way they swung the bat. I'm pretty sure that you know some of these batting stances. You know, I'm sure some of these people would not be able to, you know, swing properly. Like, like, like Angie, like you know, when she swings the bat. I mean, she has right form with the eye oh, swung early. Um, with, like, a way she's holding the bat and, and her elbow back. But, like, like look how she, like, swings it. Like, you know, she swings it, but she, like, she's not using much of a wrist. She's just, like, flailing it out there. All right. So, I'm pretty sure, like, you know, if someone tried using that, like, you know, with their real batting stance, I'm pretty sure, you know, it wouldn't be as effective. That's an out. 
Randy Johnson facing the girl who has the same, um, you know, um, skill level as he does. So, he's been 416, which is, again, not too bad for, an, you know, an average hitter in this game. Um, ball one. So, he can, again, he can, like, you know, plop one. And there's not like Brad Radke, who can't hit for crap this game with him being a pitcher. And again, Brad Radke, I feel, is one of the only guys in this game I never really got to experience, like, you know, much. Like, I never really got to watch much of him play for some reason. Well, one, because, you know, we don't play, the Pirates don't play the Twins that often. Um, I don't know, he kind of retired kind of early, I remember. So I never really got to see how good a pitcher Young ever really was. It's like, I don't think he won a Cy Young award or anything. But yeah, I gotta look up Raggy's statistics sometime. Oh my mouse! My mouse! My mouse is act is acting up. Oh. Is that, it doesn't sing here and there, wherever like you know, it does this silly little like you know glitch where you can't. Ah shoot! I couldn't get over in time. My mouse glitched a little that time. Uh, it happens. It's all right. Well, my mouse pad. Luan is batting 695 because what Luan is good at getting is just nice little easy dribblers and beating them out for infield singles, which again is probably the best thing she can really do. Again, she has good contact, but you know, for a small girl like Luan, you think she'd have a lot of power? Nah. See, that, like this, little dribbler. Doo, 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 doo. I, I had someone on my softball team who was like that. This she didn't really hit the ball that far at all, but she was pretty fast. So just like this easy little dribblers. Uh, that's good enough, though. But we got Ichiro batting here now. You are so right on that, Vinny. Let's get a power again. Because I just want to see if Ichiro can hit a home run. Okay, one time, actually, a couple, like, last, well, I can say last year, now because 2018 is in the rearview mirror. Um, I played this game for like, the first time in, like, years. And the first game I played, Ichiro had 10 for hitting, and he hit four home runs in the game. Not inside the park. If that, now, if that wall was not there... That would have probably been a home run. Oh, Ichiro fell. Alright. Let's see if we can get a home run out of this. I think we can. Yeah, we still got a home run anyway. So, sweet! A two-run inside the park home run for Ichiro. That's always fun to have. Now we've got Keisha batting, who has her hitting streak continued. I think most people have a hitting streak going um, for my team. So, I feel like Keisha's one of the more consistent hitters. Best in average is a 718 average. And again, again, Luann has like a good average too. She's our number nine hitter, but again, she speeds out so many singles with her freaking speed. She's fast. Flash just pops it up. Keisha! Oh, took a gamble there. That's what happens when you're not paying attention. So I got a double right there. Sweet! Pablo Sanchez, 677 with a single today. She's ready. Throws it. Ball one. Give me a burp. Ball one. But, um, so yeah, like, again, you know, after I finish this game, this, this, uh, season gameplay for this season, which will hopefully be the World Series victory and undefeated, um, Again, I I want to try to do backyard baseball 2009, but that's like a lot of stuff to unlock in the game. Also, I haven't really played that one as much as this one, but I will eventually try playing that. Oh, Ahmed's batting 750. Okay, I, I keep forgetting that Ahmed plays a higher average than Keisha did, but still, he's just doing awesome. But um, I try to remember there were some backyard kids that was not in uh, backyard baseball 2009. I'll probably remember that whenever I, I, I play that I play that mod. Oh, she dropped it. Uh, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, I, I could have beaten it. Oh, well. I still got, you know, an RBI out of it. Probably mostly what I've was gotten anyways. Um, but sweet. All right, no more is bad now. 6-12. The double, I mean, a single today. That's going to be way, way, way low. That was really low. Oh, we got there right by the, the caution. Um, home plate. That's a pop up. But then again, they've been dropping the balls left and right. But that, no one's going to be getting that one. My goodness, the pop was going to sneak right in there for a run. That kid just stood there and let the ball come to him. I'm batting 571 now, but I'm 0 for 1 in this game. That's 
I think Laskett had two homers. Oh, we got a new pitcher now. Francis Bluer. Don't get, get so over-exaggerated of any. Another ground ball. And they're out of the inning now. All right, but we got four runs that inning, so we're going to five to nothing. Harry Marks will lead off. He's been 350, had a little bit of a hot day, though, so watch out for Perry Marks. Foul ball. Nine pitches for Angie this game so far. Another foul ball, so good start here on Perry Marks. 0-2. Oh little side here, let's see what we got. Oop. Strike three looking nice. Three out of the four batters she's faced have struck out. We got Frances Bluer bad now. She's batting 428. She just came in the pitch, though, towards the end of that inning because Amanda Hellerman was not doing too good of a job. Nice stop by Pablo. Third over the first. Ah, uh, not quite. She beat it out. This Bluer got some decent speed. Amanda Hellerman, the center fielder now. She's batting 181, but she did not do a good job pitching. We got to her big time in that first inning. There's a going out ball down the line. We're going to get this to the runner out there at first, so not bad. I have a deal there. Rafael Garbanzos is going to bat now. He's going to bat now. I'm sorry. He, was, he has a good numbers for hitting, but he's only batting 210, so maybe we can keep him on the base and keep his bat cold. There's two outs already this thing, too, I just noticed. Oh, outside. A ball. The bomb. The Bears. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, I, I stopped a long throw or something, but we still got out of the inning, so that one... Even Lee off Salem did not hurt anything, so we're still up 4 nothing. Nice, going to the third inning. And Angie's going to lead off. Back 500 this game. 0 oh, for 1. Though today, she flied out the last at bat. Kind of batting stands really that illogical, Dimitri. You're kind of like talking trash from behind the plate, too, you know. It's something, too, you know, this... this, this, this for what it looks, it doesn't look like anybody wears the catching gear because you know, you know, the catcher would have the gear on pretty much. Also, this game also you can't specify what position your your player is. Well, you can't tell from the statistics, or you know, if you know the professional very well, like I do. Like I'm not gonna put Ichiro at third base. You know, he has good feeling numbers. He could probably work. Oh, she smacked that one deep. That one's got a chance. That was to the barrels, and that ball is just gone. Solo shot for Angela. Now six nothing Pirates here. I think I think the first time she's in a while she's had a homer. Wonder how many she has this year. How far did that go in the center field with the bouncing and everything? Is either still going or arguing? Okay, Three hundred nineteen. Okay, sweet. Not bad, Angie. We've got the big unit bat now. He's zero for one with a strike because my stupid mouse was glitching my last time I was time Randy bat. So. We're gonna get Randy a hit this time here. It's all gonna be good. That's ball one. And I'm just taking my practice swings while I wait for the pitch to get back just to kill time because I wanted to just stop and stare. That's gonna be a ball inside and it didn't get the strike call that the pitcher probably wanted. I don't know why I'm singing this song now. <laughs> I'm just weird. Oh uh, man. Uh, yep. Takes her stretch, hitch on the way. Oh, line drive, but that's gonna be foul. Uh, so she catches it, and she catches it. Dang it! Uh, oh, sweet! I just got an alert saying that my, my night shift's been been been, been canceled. Oh, sweet! I got I, I'm off from work tonight. <laughs> I can watch SmackDown. Swing and a miss. From the wind up, cuts to the plate. Five, ball, ball two. two. Sweet, that's pretty cool. I don't have to go to work tonight. Nice. I'll tell my parents that went once this once I done recording. Oh, nice little liner by Luann. Boy, she got on it. 
Wait, what? That's a home run? Are they seriously called that a home run? Jeez, wait, what has happened in the past minute here? First, I'm getting told I don't have to go into work tonight. Then I'm that one lands in a little dribbler for a home run. Like, what the? You guys, you guys just never know. I'm just, I'm in shock. All right, sweet, seven nothing. I love it. Ichiro is bad now. Ooh, my favorite uh, pro player music in this game. And Ichiro is having a hot day at the plate. So let's see what we can do here. By the way, also before I started this, apparently. You baseball fans, did you know, I don't know this till now, but apparently today is the last day uh, the Mariners field, Safeco Field, is going to be called Safeco Field. They are now being called, um, uh, as a pop-up there, a T-Mobile Park, they're going to call that. But there's also a T-Mobile Arena also somewhere. I can't remember, you know, which team had that. Ah, oh, crap. But, um, so yeah, so no more Safeco Field. We're now T-Mobile Park. Oh, well. It kind of sucked because Seiko is the same, but you know, sponsors and whatnot, you know, the whole deal, guys. Got to reset soon on the thing, but we're good. Key's just two for two. I uh, try to drive that one, but each row is going to steal. Ooh, gets away. Each row is going to take advantage of that, and he's going to come all the way around the score. Just like that. never have too many runs in this league, Sonny. You don't see that every day. We One out. A batter, not a broken so ready. So ready now. Huh? A delivery. Hit to deep right field. All right, Pablo's batting now. Hopefully, you know, that didn't get screwed up because I had, you know, um, the phone ringing there. Oh, Pablo crushed that ball deep, man! That was gone if Pablo had a little bit to the right, to the left, I mean. Man. Pablo's going for third. Will he get there? He will, so nice. Triple. Almost, probably could have had it. Ahmed Khan is at the plate now. Line drive in the center field. There's a base hit. Slow little dribbler. Oh. No, Akbet's not fast enough. If it was like Etro, I'd probably take a gamble with that. Uh, yeah, I get the text message, and then now it works trying to call me to tell him, well, like a voice blast or whatever, a, a blast to tell me that I'm not working. So that kind of inter disrupted um, the, um, the recording. Um... I, just, I already started the, the um, like the um, the audio rec recording for this video because you know I'm using my phone to record this. I, mean, I used again. I did get a microphone um, from um, my sister's boyfriend for Christmas one year. That I still do use for some of my other streams and whatnot, other videos. But I want to use it for my video game let's play because a couple times I've used it and for some reason the last like, couple seconds got cut off for some reason of my of my video since I was using you know perhaps record with, with it, so I don't, so if I like games like this, I, you know, just use my, um, my phone to, re to, re to record the commentary. Ball three. And then the football heads. Uh, nice line drive. Deep in the left field. Oh, Hellerman could not catch it. So we got, oh, what the? Again, if it was a faster runner, I'd say yes, but oh man, I, I probably could have beaten, beaten that bad throw. I'm bat now, but I'm over two. Come on, I just got told I'm not have to go to work today, so let's um get lucky here. Yeah, watch and learn. Foul ball. Oh, and two now. The target goes up, throws it. Swung on, strikeout. Foul! And the count is... Well, your calculation was wrong, Dimitri. Yeah, I love you, man, but you're, you're completely talking trash to me right now. I didn't strike out, but you'll probably get me out on a pop-out or something. 
Bases are lo no, actually, no, no, no. They're my bases are loaded, so no stop me yet. Angela had a homer her last time, and the bases are loaded, so maybe she can crack another one over the barrels in center field. Foul ball. It's fouled back. Three on, one out. Oh boy. From the wind up, cuts to the plate. Ball one. Ball one. Takes the stretch, the one one pitch. High ball and two. Five. He comes center and the throw. Oh, come on. Get, oh man, I swung too early. This kid's a good if I was someone a little a hair later, I, I probably would have crushed that one down the left field line. What? Come on, she could have hit that. Ah, rats. Oh well, we're still up ten nothing here in the third inning, so it's no biggie. Randy Johnson's over two. Had a glitching mouse strike me out out of the last at bat, but the last bat he lined out down the right field line. Foul ball. He says, here's the pit. Swinging. Line drive. Ground ball. That's where base it. There we go. Randy's got himself a hit now. Bases will still be loaded though. Eleven to nothing. Now we got Lou Ann who has a single and a weird little homer last time. Again, I don't know how that was considered a home run because it didn't I thought maybe if it went out of play it would have been a ground rule double, but yeah, Lou Ann hit a homer her last at bat. It was Weird, but she's two for two today. About seven twenty, a really good number nine hitter. Again, number nine goes. You know she's um, fast, but um, you know she's not my favorite hitter. Uh, you got the third out there though, but we're good. It's Eleven nothing after the top of the third. So we're in the away team now. I'm not used to saying that we were the home team for quite a while. But let's get some quick work here in the bottom of the third inning here because Angela's got three strikeouts. Swing and a miss. Let's give him an elevator pitch, see what he can do off of that. Uh-oh. Oh, you could not swing. What if I ever throw an elevator pitch someday? Well, I don't know, with, you know, a, um, oh, ground ball here. With, um, you know, an underhand um, or sidearm throw maybe or something like that. Vladimir Womack. He's going to bat now. No, I might... I don't know what I was going to say. I'm just, oh, come on. Why am I, well, I'm coming off the bag for some reason. I went down and missed like that. He's got himself a single. What was I doing there? I'm a better first baseman than that. Come on. Dimitri's batting now. He's batting 480, actually. I didn't notice he's had that high of average. And he's got an um, open stance. So, yeah, he can crush him when he gets into one. You know, his swing is weird. Right off the tip of his bat there for a foul ball. Dimitri Petrovich. I don't think I ever met Petrovich. I actually um, know some know a, know a family who just gave birth to a son about a year ago. And they named him Demetrius. Of course, he probably is called Dimitri, but I wonder if that is Dimitri's real name. Demetrius. That'd be a cool name to have. Demetrius. A ground ball. Randy, go up, move it. Oh, what? I dropped the ball. Oh, no. What's going on here, guys? Okay. What the guys? What in, in God's name has happened there? Dimitri keeps tripping everywhere. Even when he got in the home plate, gets an inside the park home run out of that. Guys, that was terrible. Terrible there. Well, we're still below the two, but still, that defense is unnecessary. Got him out. Ichiro. Yeah, definitely not from Ichiro. Guys, the defense is falling apart here. I'm not liking it. All right, get back on track here. Focus, guys, focus. Zena Frome's a great hitter, so let's give Angie some juice and just get her back to full strength and play a little serious here. I mean, we're still up by um, nine, but, um, you know, we can't be joking around here. Get a slow, but I'm throwing them. 
Okay, this is the height on this. Uh, oh, I couldn't get him out there. God, oh, God. Well, let's go for a double play. I'm sure we can get Perry Marks to grind into a double play. Well, he's still a decent hitter today, but we'll see what happens. Foul ball. Uh, some sloppy defense to say. That's especially my uh, my dad. That's one thing my dad can't stand when watching sports. And he would play bad defense no matter what sport it was, or it is basketball, baseball, softball. Yeah, tell Randy Johnson also to watch the birdie Angie. Okay, strikeout. We got that one there. Yeah, that's all, folks. Francis Bluer. Strike one. I better reset here real quick. Batting stats is truly lame. Foul ball. Another pitch here. Let's get him out. Foul ball again. Again, it's just, it's just like the hard ground that makes the ball harder to judge. But who, what do I know? Swing and a miss for a strike. All right, got out of that after some terrible defense, those two straight batters. Actually, that inside the park car for Dimitri, nobody could catch the ball. That was just terrible. But we're still loving two here in the top fourth thing. Each row's leading off. He is two for three with a homer and a single. That's going to be high for ball one. Uh, low for ball two. Ball two. Ball two. Each person will do the Hall of Fame. That's right. The Hall of Fame um, you know, voting is going to be soon. What are we going to get in this year? Well, that's right. Probably Mariano Rivera. Wow. That was terrible. And, I, and what? And he thought our defense terrible. Well, the guy was just standing there, couldn't even catch it. I could do much better than that. Unless the ball was going way over my head, but that went like right past him. Looked like terrible defense by the Diamondbacks there, but that's all right. They can play the bad defense all they want. My team, we play good defense. Well, not all the time. Uh, all the games we played so far has been kind of a blowout. What are you throwing to? Wow, that was a gimme there. I mean, just that one game against the Astros, we won like six to five. I remember was, was the only like close game we really had. But thanks to Keisha's big shot there, we would have lost the game. And I think the Astros are the worst team in our division. Um, which you know that's not the case in real life. The Astros are actually a pretty good baseball team with all the young talent and whatnot. Uh, after my Q and A last night, the Astros definitely my favorite team because. You know, it's true. They're one of the most complete teams there is right now. Young talent, you know, both hitting and pitching and even fielding. That's a high one and deep. Is that one got enough? It's not going to be deep enough, but we're going to get a sacrifice fly out of this. So anyway, so 11 to 2. Good base running there by Ichiro. That's why he's one of the greatest of all time. Ahmed Khan is going to bat 764. Two singles. Yeah, prepare to be rock. That's right, gonna be low for a ball, just like that. That's outside. Ball two. Who's on first base? I can't remember. I think it's Keisha. I don't know if I get a steal, but I don't feel like it. Uh, pop up. Don't go too far, Keisha. Or unless they drop it. Who knows? Yep. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, rats. That's a double play. Told you not to go too far off the bag, but we still got 20 hits. We're up 12 to 2. A power up's not going to hurt us yet. My goodness. Look at that. The Dimebacks have six errors. We have three. That's still not good, but six errors. After only three and a half innings. I remember one time the, the Pirates had a game against the Cubs a couple years ago. They had seven errors in the game. Talk about bad defense there, guys. That's not excusable, as I said before. Defense wins games. So is pitching. You know, hitting is just like, you know, the comp Mary thing. Well, I mean, you got to get hitting in order to win ball game, of course. But, you know, you got if you have better defense, something's more important. Hellerman cannot swing at anything here. We're just getting her with everything. Get a zigzag in there. 
Oh, what? Free shoe shine there. I remember one time I got a little, like, like, like a little, like, a knuckle brass knuckle shine or something like that and playing baseball like that. I almost got hit by a pitch in the hand. I could, I could feel the wind of it come, like, right by my knuckles. Ball four, rats. All right, ball four. Well, we, of course, since we produced the walk, we have to watch it. And I don't feel like it. Raphael Garbanzo, so let's give Angie some juice. Get her back to full stamina. Um, uh, of crazy buns. That was the power up. And of course, they wonders back out there for an easy ground rule double. Not the biggest deal yet. This is not a close game. Artie Pimbleton's gonna bat now. You wanna get that bunt going to the side there because of the crazy bunt? Strike one. That the old stuff. Sure, it's 42 pitches this game. Oh, that's a bit of a strike. You can throw it over the plate, Vinny. You shut up. Can't see you can do any better. You get out there. Swings and a miss. Oh, yeah. Now you compliment me, Vinny. Strike three. Nice. Six strikeouts now for Angie. We got Vladimir Womack batting now. We're related to him, the former major leaguer Tony Womack. Played for the Pirates at no one point. I think the Yankees and Red Sox. I'm trying to remember, he I think he's a Cubs too, but he was a he was a base dealer. He went fast. Good leadoff hitter. Swings and misses for a strike. But maybe he is related to Tony. Who knows? Tony Womack. We know Angela's way to Tony because of Tony Del Vecchio, or probably Anthony Del Vecchio. <laughs> probably his full name. Where have any of these guys, well, besides Griffey, of course, in this game, is actually a junior, like in the backyard kids. Like, is there, like, you know, Dmitry Petrovich Jr.? Um, well, actually, no, no, that's right, because I remember talking about that one time, Jorge Garcia told us in um, backyard soccer he is Jorge Garcia the third. So, just like me, because I'm the third also, um, we got something in common. Strike two. I protest! <laughs> well, sorry to be true. Oh, oh. Ooh, he lined that one to left field. Come on, get stop it, Keisha. At least. No, 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 no. That's going. Ah, for a ground rule double. Two more runs for Dimitri. He's got all four of the RBIs this game. Oh, boy. Oh, well. 12 4 now. Davey Mar Marion's batting now, but again, he's a good hitter, so don't take it easy on him. Oh, it goes for the bun. That was a foul. Wow. That would have been, been an easy out to get, hopefully. Two outs. Foul ball. Ah, oh boy. Uh, slow moment. Let's see if we can trick him up here. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, that's right. You can't hit that pitch. Goodbye. No more Garcia Parra is going to lead off here in the top of the fifth inning. He's batting 636. And he has three singles today. Let's get that homer down the left field line again. And that's been a pitch. That's when we call a strike anyway, so I'm going to swing. You know, because that was actually a good pitch by um, Pimbleton. Why isn't it Pimbleton? What? Come on. You should have hit that one. I, I was right on key with that. I swung at the right time. See, he was able to hit that, and that was a little more outside. Who knows? Who the heck knows? That was what I call a strike three, probably. Anyways, so I had a swing. Oh, well. I'm batting now. 566 with a single. Outside. 12 to 4. Uh, I hate whenever, like, you know, you have those random little things to share in these videos and you don't know absolutely nothing else to say. It's like, 
you know, sometimes when you like, you know, you're looking on social media, it's like you feel the urge to post something. You don't want to know what to say, but you don't want to post something just to people where you're like, oh, like you're an idiot for posting that and whatnot. Sometimes I, I literally just post like a status song here just to satisfy your urge. Who knows? Ah, oh, boy. I sometimes, you know, just, I don't know. My, my phone's like two and a half years old. Watching me three years old in May, so I'm, I'm just, you know, I keep my phone until, you know, I can't get any more use out of it, but, um, yep, you know. Sorry, the commentary's been a little, like, off this video, guys. But it's just, it happens. And Dimitri, ah, uh, the way Dimitri just falls down just cracks me up. Oh boy, Randy Johnson's batting now, 407 average, has a single this game. Ball one, two outs. Amanda Hellerman's back on the mound, probably just for a pitch, and then they're gonna switch someone else out. Here's the wind up and delivery. I fouled off the crazy ball, but it was barely anything. See, I told you, Davey Marion pitching now. Alright, shut up and quit talking. Ball one. Or ball two. Into the wind up, the delivery. There's a little line drive there, but it's going to be a nice base hit, but Angels run too fast. She's going to be out at second base. All right, that's all right. We're still 12-4. to four. Zena Frome is going to be the leadoff hitter here. Um, batting 520. Ooh, a fireball. Let's smoke her with one. Fire! Get her a little fireball here, make her a little nervous. It's like, you know, um, Randy Johnson got... Uh, John Cruck or whatever heck his name was to get all shaken up in the All-Star game that one year. He's like, I want nothing to do with him now after that pitch. And we got Zena from to strike out. Nice. Perry Marks with two strikeouts this game. Um, And you know what? Let's fireball him away as we have a juice now to get back on track with that. Strike one. How about another fireball? Let's see a second one. Going! Strike two. Let's get that. Let's get that juice back up for Angie and um, you know, because you know that was just wearing it away. Strikes out again on a screwball pitch. Francis Blue is going to bat now. Let's give her a zigzag. And that's a little low for ball one. Sixty-three pitches, ten strikeouts for Angie. Nice. That's a pretty good game for her, I shall say. Oh, it's a little high there. Ball two. A little chin music. You are so going to strike out. A bunt? Really? Well, she is fast. And she beat it out again, so, you know, can't go wrong with that. Amanda Hellerman's about it now. Uh, that's a little low. Ball one. Ball one. She just missed on that one. Oh, she's going to steal. Crap. What am I doing? I wasn't paying attention. Ah, uh, boy. Ball two. Shut up, Vinny. Foul ball by Hellerman. Another low pitch. Uh-oh. If she can get a juicer here, I might have to consider putting it maybe in, like, Luan or something to pitch. But she can pitch. Again, I just told, I just, he was, like, my third string pitcher because, um, you know, she has speed. And I don't want to lose that speed. You know, like, it's, it's needed. 
foul ball. He's really wasting the pitches on Angie. 71 pitches. Uh-oh. Foul ball. My gosh. Give her a hook. See what that does here. She's not that dangerous of a hitter. But throw a pitch in there. Okay. We got it. Nice. Okay. Got out of that inning. Now the sixth inning, 12 to 4. A lot of errors this game. 11 errors total, 7 from the Diamondbacks, 4 from the Pirates. Luan, 692, 2 for 3 with a homer and a single. I might have to throw her in the pitch here if you know Angie can't, you know, get some stamina back. Because, you know, I don't want to poke around here and, you know, make it a longer game, but, you know. Well, pop up. Will Perry Marks catch it? Yes, he will. Ichiro is going to bat next. He is three for four with the homer, double, and single. I think it's time we go for the trip, trip, triple. Get the cycle in the game. That's how. Ball one. Ball one. Ball one. Ah, he popped it up. And he got it out there, too. Keisha Phillips, man, 7-42. A double and two singles. A double and three singles today. So, again, staying hot. 7-42 average. Ball one. Oh, boy. Swung a little late there for strike one. What? So sweet, so since I'm off the rest of the day, I think I'll do the next part of my Harry Potter Let's Play and then do the baseball players, any baseball player stuff I gotta do. So, yeah, don't you just like when you get a little extra time off, especially with it being New Year's Day, of course. Um, so sweet! I remember one year I, when I worked at one of my old jobs at a, at a restaurant, I worked, um, I worked on New Year's Day, and it was probably the slowest shift I ever worked, like, ever. It was so slow. There was barely anyone who came that day, and a lot of the other other people called off that day. So, you know, since I'm a good worker and I'll call off, you know, I got to have free food that day. So, yummy. <laughs> but, um, yeah. One out now, Artie Pimpleton, who's actually a pretty fast runner, so don't poke around with him. Swings and misses for a strike. Ball one. 76 pitches for Angie. It's a lot for a kid in six innings, but I'm sure she can take it. Oh, Artie hits one deep to center. Underneath the Keisha. Keisha, what the? She literally landed like right in front of her. Okay. okay you got him down in a rundown. He's out. All right, sweet. Two outs here. Let's get Vladimir Walmack out of here and get this game over with. Okay, Angie, you don't have a lot of juice left, but, you know, he's not too dangerous of a hitter. I mean, he's batting 300, so obviously he's done some things right to get a 300 batting average. Right. Swing that. No, you could have swung that, you know, buddy. Wouldn't have done any harm. Get a corkscrew in there see what happens. And an inside pitch. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, boy. Angie's getting really low on juice. I might... Might have to bring Luann if she walks this batter. Ball four. Okay, I'm going to bring Luann and get this last batter out. Just to get a fresh, you know, um, arm in there. Get the next batter out because Angie's not gonna get any juice back and she's gonna be pitching all over the place. Shut up. We got you, Angie. Alright, so let's put, um, okay, let's, um, let's throw at second base. Um, we'll put Randy at second base because of, you know, um, stamina wise. So we'll do that. So Luann's gonna. Try to you know, close it out to get the last out of the game. Because, again, she's a good pitcher, but once again, I don't want to waste time. And her teddy goes flying. And just like that, thank you, Luann. Thank you for your help. Your services have been done properly. Thank you. All right. 
So we win this game 12 to 4. A couple little flubs there with Dmitry Petrovich batting, but um, we still got it there. I do apologize that, you know, the, um, the, um, the audio recording got interrupted twice this time because of, you know, my phone going off. But again, you know, I, I got a free day off from work and so I can Siri randomly start answer, randomly start answering a question on my phone. So again, that was just weird. But we went 12 to 4. We are 8 0 now. I'll see you guys uh, next time where we hopefully will soon be clinching our division, depending on what the Hornets and the Cardinals did, but the Hornets are second place right now. Uh, so we can be clinching a playoff spot here very soon. Uh, but yeah, so guys, as always, please click the like and subscribe or contact my channel. Follow me on Twitter at TheManAirBody3. And guys, I will see you in Game 8. I mean, sorry, yeah, Game 9 of this Backyard Baseball Let's Play um, next time. So until then, guys, I'm the Club with the Man 1993. Peace out, everybody.